Ellington kicks Dolinick. McGruder passes Dolinick. Drills the three pointer. And listen, if you're seven foot and can shoot threes, there's a place for you in today's NBA. Olenek has that rare combination. Korkmaz, no good. He'd have gone one of three from the field to start the fourth quarter. Rogic kicks to Ellington. Offensive rebound. And the basket by Olenek. Often he, you find him out on the wing, but Olenek seizing the opportunity to go inside and dig out that extra possession. Here's Korkmaz, and not sure what he was thinking there. In transition, here comes Miami. Ellington leading the charge. The feed now to Dragic. And we're about two minutes into the fourth quarter now. And on an open look like that, he's very gifted at making the weak coverage pay. Fultz dishes to Ilyasova, and Ilyasova throws it down. Yeah, Ilyasova will sneak up on you sometimes and throw him down like that. Miami's gotten just one of four three-pointers to go down for them here in the fourth. Rogic kicks to Olenek, and there's the pass to Magruder. He dishes it to Dragic. Passes to Babbitt. Here's Magruder. No good on the three. For Philadelphia, they've gone three of six in the field so far in the fourth quarter. So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the contact right there. And love the high motor Fultz brings to the floor. Really puts the defense in a tough spot whenever he drives inside. And the 76ers with some changes. Rashawn Holmes, he's checked in for Johnson. Justin Anderson comes in for Korkmaz. And it's T.J. McConnell in for Luwabu. He'd also with the sub. Adebayo's checked in. Philadelphia's gotten off to an 0 for 2 start from downtown here in the fourth quarter. And Fultz gets it to go. And Fultz isn't bashful inside. He feels at ease shooting in the paint. Pass to Autobio. Outside Dragic. Some nice ball movement here by the Heat. Inside. Pass to Autobio. Kicks it to Babbitt. That's it. Coming off an assist from Dragic. Dragic has got three assists in the game. To the left wing. Deep two from Anderson. Not enough on that one as it misses. Yeah, and something we always talk about, though, shot selection. Well, being aggressive is one thing, but aggression with control is another. And you need both elements working together. Holmes can't get it to go in. The defensive reaction time, it was just immediate on that one. And sometimes the most important part of that is the angle that the defender chooses. That time, he chose wisely. Here's Dragic from outside, and it's Philadelphia with the rebound. Holmes got his fourth rebound in this one. Yeah, this has been a night where you can look at his shooting and his performance, and it's affected the team. That's the bottom line. He was all alone on that one. And it's six points for Markel Fultz. How about the quick fire release of Fultz? It is difficult to guard. You know he's thinking about shooting as the pass is coming his way. Ellington kicks to Babbitt. The three knocks down the three ball. And in that first half, guys, they didn't shoot nearly as many threes as they have here in the second, trying to use that shot to stay in the game. A shot by McConnell, no good. Not quite enough defense. That time around, just lucky he was off. Johnson, he's checked in for Miami. Now Dragic, the pass to Autobio. Here's Magruder. Passes it to Autobio. Lock at six. Here's Magruder. He's guarded by Johnson. From beyond the arc, it's tipped, and it's out of bounds. Last touch by Reddick. And they force the shot clock violation. Great team. 76ers have gone 5 of 11 from the field in the fourth quarter. Here's Simmons. 
And he converts the layup. And what skill from Simmons. A total genius at reading the defense and exploiting them in the paint. Rockets the pass to Babbitt. Magruder kicks to Johnson. They set the pick. Now the dish to Dragic. Shot clock at six. He feeds it to Johnson. Here's Adebayo. And that's out of bounds. Miami will retain possession. Wayne Ellington's checked in for Rodney Magruder. Here's Babbitt. Dragic kicks to Johnson. Back to Dragic. Dishes it to Babbitt. Feeds it to Dragic. Two minutes. Two minutes left. The fourth quarter. Just five on the clock. A step back shot here. Good on the bucket. Once Dragic gets around the pick there, he catches the ball and lets it fly. Love the energy and admire the confidence. Simmons dishes to Johnson. It's stolen by Sharks. In it goes for the eighth time in 10 tries. Still attacking, building on this lead, coming down the stretch. Well, tonight his pinpoint accuracy has been impressive. Babbitt kicks to Johnson. The feed to Dragic. Six on the shot clock. Pass to Ellington. He kicks it to Dragic. Another miss by Dragic. 76ers have gone 7 of 13 from the field here in the fourth. A tremendous boost for these guys as this game winds down. And what will be a win here in game one of the series for the 76ers. And this was one that never really was in doubt, I thought, an all-around dominant performance. And you kind of thought that maybe even going into the game. Yeah, there was a sense of that in men. They, they just pretty much blew them right out of the water. A clinic was put on display here today. And, you know, looking back at all the contributions tonight, it was a really phenomenal all-around game for Dario Scharch. Uh, he came in with a focus and brought that dominant performance to the defense all night long, controlling the pace of the game and was firing on all cylinders. McConnell kicks to Fultz. Misses the three. On the wing, Johnson. He's covered by Anderson. And he was fouled on the way up. Two free throws now for him. Yeah, easy call. The first free throw is good. Rashawn Holmes, he's checked in for Amir Johnson. And both free throws good for Babbitt. 34 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Now, here's Fultz. To the wing right side. Holmes passes to Fultz. So he gets the whistle. Contact on the way up and two shots coming up. And Fultz is a menace inside. Superb at making the D foul him when he's this close to the basket. That one is off. He hits the second from the line. Here's Dragic. On the wing, Johnson. Using his post move to get the two points. And nice court vision from Dragic there to get a great look at the bucket. And here's McConnell. So it's the 76ers winning this one easily. A pretty good feeling right now for them to be out in front like this in the series. You know, Kevin, momentum so, so critical. And you know they'll want to ride this wave into game two. And that about wraps it up for this broadcast of the NBA Eastern Conference quarterfinals. For Greg Anthony, Brett Berry, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan. Thank you for watching the NBA, presented by 2K Sports. So long and good night, everyone.